Hey, it's Coley if you don't know, and it is time for some more of The Long Run, where we are playing ukulele. So last time we did a pretty sizable chunk of Tribal Stack Tropics. We didn't actually finish, but uh, we got a lot of it done. Uh, so this time is going to be it's going to be the time to go into the lands of ice, uh, whose name I can't quite remember, but it's gonna it's gonna be heckin' uh, heckin' greasy. All right. Also, it looks like I am going to have to bump this down again. Wow. Am I actually going to have to just do this on... Okay. I was hoping to be able to, to do this um, at a little bit higher quality, but unfortunately it looks like I'm just going to completely miss my jump and also going to have to do this on like the fastest graphics. Um, I don't know why this game is so intensive. It's like th this so far has been the only game that my computer has struggled to uh, to do. So I don't know, it's weird. Dr. Quack was actually Dr. Cul-de-sac before a typing error on his medical license. What a U-turn. Uh, might be that. Might be just my computer just doesn't like this game. Like the video card. I don't know. Anyway. Can't believe my computer can't handle collect-a-thons. Hey, Darian. And my computer, let me tell you, it's pretty, it's pretty good for when it was built, except that the video card is uh, definitely not top of the line for when it was built, and right now I can't afford to upgrade it. There we go. So we've already expanded this town. So we're just going to see the full version of it from the beginning. Oh, jeez. Is that it? We spent our pages on a key? Hmm, the second ice key. Well, two is better than one. Gee, I wonder what they're referencing here. What a ripoff! I was expecting an extra continent! Uh, I, I absolutely swear to you, I have no idea why it's ice keys. Hmm. I can't quite make that. You know, like your computer not handling Mass Effect. RPGs are the only thing. I do for it ran at five frames an hour. Yeah, that's uh, there's definitely some uh, slideshow effects going on there, Rhea. Also, hello. I'm gonna run into this person. It's gonna be great. I hope you're doing well tonight. Ghost Rider in there. Uh, we got, uh, I forget your name. Vendi, yes. All right, I, for some reason, these guys are like really hard to actually Destroy? I 
Naps are good. What are these pots here? What is a Spyro? I can get up here as a result. Hmm. Ah. I'm gonna guess that I cannot get past this uh this fire here. I'm probably going to need to bring in some ice oh geez. That's too cold for our feet. Alright. Yes, yeah, so we might need to go talk to our quote unquote buddy trouser. There he is. Welcome. Lovely to see you. How do you read the new office? Or. You don't even have a roof over your head. Ah yes, Trouser Co. apologizes for any inconvenience while we refurbish our premises. Before I showcase our latest stunning maneuvers, can I offer you a cup of tea, coffee, pirate movie disc? No thanks, Trouser. We're only interested in the moves today. Hold up, Yuka. What movies does he have? So if we didn't get them in the first level, we can get them now. And uh, looks like we have two moves and we can afford both immediately. But before I do that, we're going to just immediately take a moment to stretch. Mm. Normally you think that we would do like a little ways into the stream, but I am okay with it. Check our posture. And learn about slurp state. Top choice. Are you sure this is the move you're after? Sure is. This next move is banned in three different modern game genres. Is it the quality assurance move? Hydrate, huh? Okay. Um, I think there's a little glitch with this text there, buddy. Hydrate has been achieved. Of course not. Anyway, I've noticed my green friend's tongue isn't quite as spectacular as it should be. With this upgrade, your slurp ability will seriously be improved with the ability to absorb the properties of your food. That sounds cool, Trouser. What kind of properties can I absorb? Fire, sticky honey, other bits. Have a look on the internet. There's probably a list on there. Right, I guess that was an actual joke. That completely went over my head until you re post, uh, po pointed it out to me. Thank you. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Lizardly. Top choice. Are you sure this is the move you're after? And this next move is crucial. Huh? If you're go ever going to beat Trousers' impressive athletics records. I don't think that'd be much trouble. The lizard leap will allow you to perform an impressive high jump. Just hold left trigger and press A to jump. That sounds useful. Thanks, Trouser. No sweat. Now I must dash. They're naming a strain after me in honor of my service to deals. Sure they are. Leaving so soon? Be quick, these deals are here for a limited time only.
So I am also going to guess that the water probably hurts too. No? I would have thought that it would be, it'd be like too cold or something. Anyway. So now, if we go back to the beginning, we should be able to get up there. There we go. Ah, okay, ice physics it is. And what's in here? Crystalline cave. Oh, geez. All right, well, we got the um, energy extension. Still not entirely sure what uh, what we just acquired here, but it's expired now. Oh, what's this? Oh, uh, you're friendly. Wait, it seems I had to. Uh... Away it seems to have fled in the hat that was on my head. Okay, I'm looking for a hat, I guess. Bunch of elements here. Y'all can get wrecked. I was wondering if maybe I could melt those, but uh, apparently not. What's this about, though? Huh. I think this is a hint to that, but how do I, like, do I need to hit them with fire? No. Hmm. Okay, and that seems to just be an exit. I am getting no indication that anything is happening, and uh, generally when it comes to um, to like this sort of game. Yeah, this, 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 and this. Yeah, it's just not doing anything. If it, if it was doing something, it would tell me that it's doing something. Uh, we'll come back to that. 
Let's see what's through this door. Okay, so we're pretty much back where we started. Um, that's just this, uh, this little side area again. Now keeping in mind we cannot touch this ice, at least not yet. Oh wait. Yeah, let us touch this ice. So it must have just been like in that other area where it was like super chilled or something, I don't know. Um, so I, I remember, uh, Yuka was trying to say something and it just kind of got interrupted. It's 50% more ice than the, uh, the, uh, other leading ice. It's in here. Dang it. Not sure how I managed to get hit twice there, but whatever. What is the correct way to hit you? Well, that kind of wrecked us. But which ice is the most ice? Let's see what's in here. And now we're just kind of messing around and uh, seeing what we can see. Well, there's a ghost rider here. Or, of course, they put the ghost rider that we chase around in the ice area. But, um, quick work of that one. I'm feeling far less manly without that mizzen hat of mine. I got some news. Being manly is uh, not the be all and all of all. That was a statement. There we go. So all that's left in that little side area is uh, a um, snowman missing their hat. I guess I should say about missing his hat. For being a femboy when in boy mode. Well, if you feel comfortable that way, that is the important thing. So I'm going to guess that I just need to completely destroy these people's village. Yeah. I'm over here, you. 
area. Ow. Okay, so I need to hit you when you stop glowing, is what I'm learning here. Who are you? Oh. Oh, thank goodness Elf has arrived. The nearby tribe of monsters is holding a rather valuable artifact. Hostage. You mean that smelly old pot? That's about as valuable as Yuka's old socks. That pot is antique, I'll have you know. Oi, what did you call me? Please help. The tribe are preparing to, for dinner inside their homes. We'll need to pound their roofs. In, yeah, we'll need to pound their roofs in if we have any chance at escape. All right, Doctor Bones, we'll help. Unlike you, we've got the stomach for this adventure game. Hey, Lee. There we go. And to destroy the homes of a whole community. We are the heroes. I am the champions. No time for losers, because I am the champions. Wow, you really smashed those houses. The tribe will never recover from this. I suppose they could igloo them back together. You could please. Please take your reward. Damn. Political comments from Rhea here. Getting real here. Getting real with Rhea. <laughs> That's cold, Yuka. That is super cold. Once again, I've made it to like the highest of heights and probably for nothing. Um, I'm going to die. Oh, landing in the water. Not sure what I can do with this. Oh, look, it's Cardos. Also, not sure what I can do with this. I don't know what the. Um... Okay, well, I can't get back up there now. And it clearly doesn't make us heavy enough to not be buoyant. Howdy, folks. How's the adventuring? We could have done it. Uh, we could have done without your help to navigate around that dodgy. Qu uh, we could have done with your help uh, to dodge around that. Not uh, ah, whatever. I can't see it anymore. Ah, shucks. How about we go for a ride instead? Find some of them pretty gems. Sure. Go no on then. Let's warm in there anyway. Great. Jump in the back and let's go. It's the page year after. Y'all gonna need to find 100 gems before you reach the finish line. You need to know the controls, critters? Ah, we're good. Now, this ain't your first rodeo. Y'all jump inside and let's go for a ride. 
Uh, we already did one quiz, yes indeed. Okay, so we can jump on the heads of those, uh, those things. I imagine we can probably do that, like, um, out in the field as well. Dang. Oh, and that's an instant loss. What the dickens was that, fellas? We didn't even make it to the end. Let's see if we try again. Ooh, we let's go. Dang. Ah. I feel like I'm doing worse this time, honestly. Yeah, we had 51 go getting to that point last time. Let's avoid jumping there to get the prize. And we got enough. Yeehaw! Nice one, partners! Ooh-wee! What a ride! Of course, riding the tracks was even more exciting back in the good old days. But I guess I'll take what I can get. Y'all don't know how lucky you is with, it, with these checkpoints and speed bursts. You see, my day. Uh, yeah, very interesting, Cartos, but, uh, we better run. Lots of stuff to do and things to collect. Thank goodness that's over. I was about to die of boredom. Maybe, please. That wasn't so bad. Um, yeah, the poor bandit because fans wanted Grunty's board game from the end game. And honestly, uh, Grunty's board game from the end game was, um, like a lot better than uh okay so we cannot jump on those guys we actually have to spin into them to destroy them but um yeah like it was a lot more like game show-ish yeah, yeah it was more more than a quiz like i recently watched uh raokao play through banjo kazooie and like he was super hyped for the uh the board game portion of it and he's like i really hope it holds up from my memory and then he played it and he's like yeah this completely holds up um as for the quiz the quizzes in this game spoilers um yeah it's uh, a lot more cut and dry pretty much you just answer the questions and if you answer quickly then you get two spaces instead of one but it's just a linear board it's kind of a shame Yeah, those those can be pretty good, Jewel. Um, the hundred percent speed runs of Kazooie and Tui, but just the the ways that people can figure out to uh, to navigate the world like as fast as possible. I think there's a cave down there, isn't there? Yeah. But uh, 
Yeah, as for Kartos being more of a DKC thing, um, you're not wrong. <laughs> I think it's just kind of platonic wanting to do as much of the thing that they're known for as possible. Oh, looks like eating the, the green things here is a very illuminating experience. Hmm, all right. Come on, there you go. Ah. Hmm. I wonder if um what was the button? There we go. Yeah, there we go. Usually I'll watch like Tess's, not like um, real time speed runs. I don't know if that's the same for Jewel or not. And my aim is fantastic. I don't know what you're talking about. We managed to avoid running out of light so far, which is good. Oh, geez. Okay, you get Angie. Gotcha. Well, we ran out of light, but right next to a light source. So not so bad. Uh, where? Okay. Moving platform here. Thanks to this one here. Real time speedruns are also good. Like, they're, they're good for different reasons, right? Perfect. Um, I hope this is where, I, yeah, there was, uh, there's some quills over here. Here we go. Pagey and a cagey. Release. I think that takes us back to the beginning, possibly. Uh, if it does, I'm not really sure where it is. Yeah, I definitely remember this part. Is it up here? Ah, there we go. Lock two, let's go.
Come on, where's the surface? There we go. Would like not to drown. Drowning is generally not advised by the Surgeon General. The, the Sturgeon General, however, might have different opinions. Wait, where am I going? Oh, okay. I appreciate that uh, it actually showed like the direction that I'm supposed to go. But where am I going now? Okay. KG and KG release. There we go. Nope, can't get up there. Uh, that we've already been there anyway. Um, hey, buddy. If you're not sure where to go, pretty much just look for um, pretty much just look for quills. Usually, that can give you a pretty good idea of where you haven't been. Also, it looks like uh, Doctor Puzz is here. All right, fish head. Still in the science business? Oh, very much so. In fact, I've just made the final collaborations to the to the DN Ray, and it's ready for transformationing. With this latest modification, we'll really be able to teach that creep Dr. Quack and his new boss a lesson. Just make sure you press the correct button. The last transformation won't last long in this weather. For this next transformation, I'll need you to bring me this squirrel's molly cool. But it seems like you haven't found it yet. Keep searching. Alright. So we, we have officially now been dispatched to find the molly cool for this area. Uh, anything in this closed vicinity? It looks like no. Let's go check out what's in here. Uh, well, we've definitely been here already. Wait, were we? I don't know. Listen, I get turned around real hard in this kind of game, so. Don't mind me. I am going to continue to be a dork. As, as some might say, a dorkus malorcus. Okay, so this uh, this ice here is still slippery, but just not as slippery as it would be without um, giving the honey a licking. Yes, I know what I said. Um, nope. I think what we gotta do here. Gonna be just ah. So we're going to need to roll this out. No, that's not what I meant to do, but that's fine. In order to be able to get up there fast enough.
Dang. Oh, come on. Can I, like, flutter over there? No, I sure can't. I think enemies respawn, too, so even if I was able to shoot them down... Hey, wait. Can I get up there? Yes! Well, that gives us plenty more time. Ow. Okay. So now Oh, you're gonna make us do this. All right. Probably going to have, like, enough time to get these. Yeah, there we go. Before I need to go refill on honey. Ah. One of the two ice keys in this level, which is definitely something that has never been explored before in a, you know, rare slash platonic game. Completely new and, yeah. Oh geez, what's this? Icy metric palace. I have no, um... No camera control in this area. Okay. Okay, so this is another one of these. Oh, geez. Um, oops. Hey, how many of these are there? Holy crap. Okay. So basically, you just want me rolling from the beginning. What the? There we go. 
Oh. One second left. Building work by Eric Weekwall Partners. Let me put the week in weak walls. Okay. Okay, so we cannot get blown up by our own bombs. That's good. So let's go check out this area, I guess. Okay, I was I was wondering maybe like by getting the fire here. Oh, there we go. Um So that unlocks this gate up here, which stays unlocked, all right. Oh, that just goes down. Oh good, there was another platform. All right, so dying just brings us right back here. So basically minimal consequence, just good. Decor by Edward Solstice Painters Limited will plaster your palace. I don't know if that's a British thing or what. Puking ice sounds like piss. Oh, hello. We don't get visitors down here very often. My name is Bernie, and I'm in charge of the heating in this palace. You've not been doing a very good job. It's freezing. Yeah, so I like to keep the energy bills down, but it's never been this cold before. Any chance you could warm up the place, Bernie? There's no way I'll be able to spark a flame in this temperature. My innards are frozen solid. Want us to take a look? We've gotten quite good at problem solving. Go on, then, but don't touch anything. I have a very sensitive stomach. Hey, warm my innards up quick. Guessing this is a boss? Well, who dares enter the overly cramped layer of the mighty breeze block? Can't you see this boiler is occupied? Hello there. What is the, um, dentist? You need to check the health of Bernie's molars. Yep, all seems to be in order here. Nonsense! 
You're here to thaw me out and evict my damp puddly remains out of this boiler and, on, and onto the street, are you? Pretty much, yeah. Then I will deliver your frosty end before you get the chance. Ow. Ah, look what you've done. I'm melting. You two are right, pain in the icicles. Ow. I'm gonna have to watch out now. Down to one uh down to one hit left. I knew buying that scorchberry bush would come back to haunt me. Why would you buy a scorchberry bush when you know that would, you know, cause damage to you? Ow. Well, it was a close fight, but unfortunately, we gotta do it again. Uh, exact same. Might help if I wasn't quite so careless, you know, just a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean like a lot, because wow, I'm taking a lot of unnecessary hits. I do wonder why this fan here is there. Like, is there a point to that? I actually managed to clip the shots into the floor. That's kind of amazing. Maybe that's just for protection, too. Ow. 
once again clips the shots into the floor. How are you still alive? There we go. Oh no! I knew I should have locked the boiler door. What a sad end to my 48 hour reign of terror, frosting up this boiler. Tell my family I went out doing what I loved. Firing projectiles at an interspecies buddy duel. Yeah, that uh, that went on for a little bit. Ooh, much better. You two heroes put a fire in my belly. This means I can warm the palace back up. Keep an eye out for the floor grates. The thermal heat will surely come in handy. But now my concern is like, how do I get back in there? I wonder though if I can like, no. Cause it it opened like a a grate back there, but it it forced me out of the room is the problem. Oh, there's another pagey. What a niche hobby. Yeah, it's not one that uh, that really happens very often, does it? Well, for some reason, wasn't expecting that to be lit. Which honestly, I should have. There we go. I do wonder if there's like something down here. Like if I can take the platform down in a very specific spot and get something out of it. No. We've already solved that puzzle. So let us go back. And there's without a doubt more stuff to do in this palace. Now there's something interesting there. Yeah, there's a a bunch of retro coins down there. I wonder what the deal is with that. Oh geez. Okay, so obviously you want me to rush through this. Well there's a retro. Also there's a uh secret path behind you. Lately, I sense a trap. I think we should choose wisely. Hmm. It couldn't possibly be the one that's rotating differently, could it? Turns out that's exactly the one. Friends! Here to try Ruxtro's new arcade game? Hold on, I thought your work patch was in that other world. Money tight in Ruxtro household. This is the second evening shift. Sorry to hear that, Ruxtro. I didn't know you old game characters could multitask. Are you ready to try next arcade game? Did you bring Flakoin? 
You got your silly coin, Polygon Boy. Oh, good. Please approach Arcade and press A. If you beat game, Rex drunk his special prize. And do. Um. Why is it so complicated to get to your machine here? Your friends want to play a fun arcade game? Yep. I think I caught that it was called Glaciators. Yeah. If players like quills and corplet battles, then this is definite this is definitely arena brawler. Oh, okay, it's, it's as if uh Rockstar was saying it. If players like quills and corplet battles, then this is definitely arena brawler for you. I'm pretty sure there's only one arena brawler that's really for me right now. Especially since that arena brawler doesn't like take away take the floor away from under me. But as usual, the goal of the first run is just simply survive. Ow. Okay, that invincibility didn't lo didn't last as long as I thought it would. Ow. Also, it looks like I might be actually dropping uh, quills when I uh, when I get hit, so I want to not get hit. It should go without saying. Now what's the score I have to beat anyway? Because right now I'm at 2100, looks like. Well, I survived anyway. Nice! Game is won! Did friends have fun? Yeah, it was alright. You're not going to ask us to submit a five-star review, are you? Oh no, Rextro bribed important reviewers long time ago. That's some commentary. Feel free to try game again. This time, if friends beat high score, Rextra give another prize. Well, let's give that another go. Uh, what's going to be the score to beat? 1400. All right. I think we got this, guys. Because the game doesn't really change the second time around, but we do need to do it again for another pagey. All right, uh, we are back. So hopefully we didn't lose too much there.
the game is the game does tend to be good about auto saving, so um Should be fine. We probably are going to have to start the um Oh. Alright, you're putting us back at the entrance of Glitter Glaze Glacier. Okay. Well. Not much that could have been done about that, unfortunately. Also, I didn't see these uh these quills over here the first time. It's a very interesting texture. Uh what's the button for First person view. There we go. Okay. So let's check our totals. There's all of the snowmen here. That's cool. Um Totals for this area. So we're at 7 of 25. So I don't think we actually lost anything. Other than our position. You you should work on your confidence, my friend. Uh, let's see. Uh, I guess let's start uh, wandering again. It probably saved the first one, Tyrion, but I doubt it's... Well, obviously it didn't save the second one, because we were in the middle of the second one. But um, the fact remains, we're going to have to find our way back there. And I have no idea which direction back there is, because do I ever know where I'm going in this sort of game? Hey, buddy. Finally, you're here. Hurry up and get to work, or Planker's Fire would for sure. Good, this level needs warming up. Shut it, goth girl. Now, do what sculptors are paid for and sort out that dodgy statue. But we're not. Quiet! Get to work! When Capital B find, uh, finds out I accidentally boshed his nice new sculpture, he'll put me in a neighbor dispute complaint for sure. You'll need plenty of power to fix those imperfections, for sure. I don't think we're equipped to, uh... Stop rambling and fix that statue. You sculptor types are all the same. All talk, no action. If you want your payment, you better get a move on. Payment? Yes, sir. Gee, I wonder what the payment could be. Bye. Hmm. Yeah, we're probably gonna need some fire for that. Alright. And for this thing here. Perfect. Masterpiece. All right, next thing. <laughs> oh, geez. I don't know how that wasn't fall damage, but sure.
Oh boy. Can't wait to be paid in dollars with eyes, which we will give to Conquer for Pagey. Ow. Get out my face. Okay, can't do that. No, he probably can, yeah. Well, looks like we're heading for another trip. Oh, geez. Please don't fall. There we go. I hear something. There is definitely something back there. We are going to need to make this long trip here. Not sure how I made that, but it's fine. Hey, it's the Molly Cool. All right. That is a valid question, Tyrion. Um, I think the general idea is um, make fewer larger worlds so that we don't have to come up with as many ideas and still have the same amount of gameplay, except that I don't know if that was the best way to do things. All right, there we go, perfect. Oh, there's a raid, what's going on? D-bomb, raiding for, with three viewers, thank you very much. Um, Planker was saying something there, but unfortunately I missed part of it. Here you are then, take your award and clear off, use the sculptors. Thanks, Planker, but we're not Enough talk! Clear off! Thank you, Tyrion. Let's see... Yeah, more worlds with the same assets would have been better. I definitely agree with that, uh, Tyrion. D-Bomb, welcome to Let's Play the World Live. How you doing tonight? Anyone who who might not be aware of this place, which I don't know who all came here, but uh, you know, uh, I'm cool. You, if you don't know, this is Let's Play the World Live. I am a variety streamer. Uh, currently, I'm streaming uh, ukulele. I'm also streaming Kirby and the Forgotten Land on on uh, Saturdays. And also um, doing Archipelago Multiworld on Sundays. Okay, so that's that's what I needed to do here. Dang. Well, y'all are just gonna keep running away. I am doing pretty well. Um, <laughs> We're we're a little bit recovering here from a uh, brief power outage. Um, the new Kirby game is honestly pretty great. Um, we just got to the end of um, the story with the last stream, so right now it's just oh geez, 
Right now it's just losing three health from falling from high places. But uh, yeah, right now it's just uh, rescuing the remaining hidden waddledees. Um, which we haven't actually started on. We we kind of ended the last stream with uh, the ending of the game. Okay. Now let's do this a little better, because we need to get that Ghost Rider. Oops. Well, ran out of energy. All right. Fortunately, if we just sit here for a second, it'll come back. There we go. That's not what I needed, because I definitely hit this uh, this ice. I guess I absolutely need to hit it with fire. The only fire I can see is like down there. I can't like that fire, unfortunately. Oh, there's a, there's a fire plant over here. Okay, what's up? Because I, I hit it with explosions, I hit it with fire, what is going to work? I just plain hit it, and it's just not breaking. What's up? Oh, whatever. Hmm. I wonder if... Because we, we also hit that pile over there with, uh, with bombs, which also didn't work. Knock an enemy into it? And maybe. For now, I want to give something else a try. Hopefully this uh, fire can last long enough. Nope, it didn't last long enough. The idea was to um, hit that uh, pile of snow with fire. Might also work to try it with explosions. Just one more time, but I'm pretty sure I've already tried that. Yeah, that's not doing anything. Ah! So I wanted to give the explosion one more try, but I ran out of time. You think you know from an old stream? Uh, please do impart. Because I would rather not be sitting here trying things for like the next five hours. That was my next guest, Tyrion, actually. And uh, Dr. Puzz is right there, so let's, uh, and I do have the Molly Cool, so let's go do that right now.
All right, all right, fish head. Still in the science business? Okay, we've already seen all this. We found your molecule, Doc. Magnificent! If you're ready to start the transformation, approach the DN ray and press A. Hold still, though, it might sting. Are you ready to transform? Let's do it. Ah, uh, okay. Extraordinary, a snowplow! I wasn't expecting that. To accelerate, use a love stick, and to boost, use X. Also, would you mind clearing my driveway? A pretty good jump going on, too. How do I do against ice? Ice is not a problem. Oh. Small spaces definitely are a problem. Whoa, geez. Alright, and contact with water cancels the transformation. Things that we are learning. Wait, there let me let me take a closer look at that transformation. I didn't see the two pairs of eyes. Oh yeah. Now I see it. Oh geez. Okay. I thought for sure that I was falling into the abyss there, but apparently not. I definitely fell off that time. All right. Oh, well, and there is a fair amount of acceleration to to this uh, transformation here that we need to worry about. Come on, come on, there we go. Oh, oh, saved it. We are so totally falling off. Oh, no, we didn't. Found a pair of pants, though. Well, hey, bring that back here. It'll give you a massive hug. The, the, I, okay. I don't know if a hug is exactly what we want. Okay, so that still hurts us. And also, that is absolutely not where I was meaning to go anyway. Means they patched the movement. Oh, geez. Well, that was a poor decision. Uh, well, this is the only transformation I can do in this world. Um, it's basically sort of like Banjo Kazooie, where there's like a different transformation in every world. Unfortunately, this is not the solution to uh, to break that. But I still don't really know what that is.
Yeah, the first time I played this, I'm, I'm not sure how close it was to uh, the game originally coming out. Uh, I think it probably was like 2018 or something like that. Well, here we are back at the Crystalline Cave. Gosh, top work. Now be a gent and bring it back to me. Um, I can't talk to thou now that you've been turned into a plow. Oh, fair enough. You're going to be plowist like that. And I still don't know how to interact with those. Oh, there has to be more to do with that transformation. Um, I'm not sure. Well, for for one thing, we can definitely go on this like super cold ice now. Whether that's useful at all is uh undetermined. It definitely seems like like we need to come here as natural form. And now we're just gonna die. No? Alright, well. We did not die. But yeah, this this here is what it's expecting from us, I think. It's also a lot easier to control where I'm going. Oh, right, you're the one that I have to fight. Ow. We gonna die, yeah. So where does that put us back? The last place we exited from, of course. Oh, geez. Oh, we managed to not fall into the water. And I'm a face. I managed to damage boost to safety that time. No! Okay, so I guess the uh, the damage that I did to that Ghost Rider uh, carried over. Another torch. I hope the roof doesn't melt down.
Also, I'm pretty sure I restored my fire here. And yet it just kind of super quickly ran out. I don't know. There we go. Looks like we found all of them. Let's raise the temperature a few, uh, a few degrees. Let's get out of here, Yuka. You find all sorts of horrible critters in caves. Yeah, that definitely seems like it's removed the uh, the glacial penalty from this area. Oh, you're on a pagey rampage. A pagey rampagey. If you're looking for more challenges, remember to expand the Grand Tomes to make their worlds even bigger. Yeah, we all know all about that. Well, looks like uh, the civilization here was able to rebuild in the amount of time that it took for me to recover from my uh, power outage. Let's go ahead and transform again. We'll be able to take that door back to uh, hit that. Um... Can I hit this? No, of course not. Okay. <laughs> Me still thinking that I can damage these guys in this form. My hat, I need you to look slick. So bring it back here, quick, quick, quick. So with the knowledge that they can rebuild in basically no time, Let's go ahead and destroy their civilization again, just for no real reason. Is this a Banjo-Kazooie-like game? Yes, indeed it is, and it is in fact made by a lot of the same people. Um, they're basically Rareware expatriates that uh, formed Platonic and um, made this game. Not really sure what I was trying to prove there. Yeah, I'm... Hmm. Ow. Jerk. Let's go ahead and detransform. Uh, do I have your hat? Golly gosh, I'm proper again. Thing, my thing's peculiar, is it? Huh? It's like I do have your hat. Safely falling in the water. Oh, there's a button here. Let's give that a try. All right, that does not appear to be timed, but I'm probably going to need this because I'm pretty sure what it does is make it so that I don't get affected by... Oh, right, I have the high jump now. Forgot about that. Mm -mm. There we go. So 
that opens that up. That opens that up, but now my um, cannonball thing ran out. So I'm probably just going to need to refresh on that here. Dang. KG and a KG, release. Unfortunately, we got blown off the edge here before we could uh, get that KG, but there it is. Up to 19 in stock right now. That's probably about enough to, uh, to fully expand the next Grand Tome, but uh, we're going to work as much as we can to uh, clear this one out here. I go lie down. Collecting all the pages in the cages. You got it, Tyrion. Thanks for dropping by. And sorry if I'm a bit meandering here. Um, unfortunately, in these um, kind of super open world games, I do tend to get a little lost. I would like to find the uh, the palace again though. Is this it? No, it sure isn't. This is the crystalline cave. Yeah, like I absolutely don't remember where that is. <laughs> gotta get to my place, gotta get to my place, gotta get, ooh, shiny. Especially when, especially when you're trying to, like, you're, you're trying to get somewhere, but at the same time, like, hunting for resources definitely doesn't hurt. Especially when you have mining and engineering. Is this the palace? This looks very palacey. No, it sure isn't. It just takes me here. Really, I should have recognized this. Ah, yes, mount hunting. There's one particularly rare one in Northrend that uh, I remember spending an inordinate amount of time trying to get. Um, I don't remember the name of the place. It was the... Hmm. I think it's where the Sons of Hodir are. The Time Lost Proto Drake. Yes, exactly. Storm Peaks. That's the one. Unfortunately, never got it. But uh, that would have been cool if I did. I will not deny, Jewel. That that is uh, that is an annoying one to get, and uh, that you got it. I congratulate you.
Oh, there's some quills over there. Hey, don't go underwater. I need to... What's up here? What's your deal? Do I have your hat? I didn't find your hat. Engaging gameplay of sitting around for a month. While other people are probably also doing the same thing. Um, so how do you expect me to get to that platform over there again if, I, if this platform isn't moving? Okay. KG and a KG, release. I assume by SL you don't mean Second Life. Yeah, I haven't played um World of Warcraft in quite some time. I do remember getting the on zoom out though. Um that took quite some time to uh to actually get done, especially considering like it was uh you had to do that one dungeon in heroic mode. And of course, you can only do it like once a day. So, yeah, so the calls. Uh, also, try. I, I also spent a lot of uh, time to get that one. Um, Phoenix Mount from uh I want to say Tempest Keep is that is that the one Yeah, originally had to to have a Druid with Swift Flight. Yeah, I I actually remember. I actually remember. I had a Night Elf Druid. Uh it was it was uh during um Wrath of the Lich King which is when I started playing. Uh, I had a, a Night Elf Druid at... And I remember getting to level 75. Ashes of Alara, yeah, that was, that was the one. I remember getting to level 75 and then freezing my level there so that I could get into that dungeon uh, in heroic mode using the, um, you know, the LFG function. Because level seventy five was the latest that you could possibly do that dungeon, right? Uh, in the uh, the LFG. Um, because I like it, it was possible to do um, the flight quest in the old way as well as the new way at that time, and so I wanted to get it done in the old way if at all possible, and. Um, yeah, I I remember I remember we got to uh the Anzu fight and then we we lost a character. I think we lost like uh, our tank or something. And that was after like trying to queue for that dungeon for like probably over a week if not more than that. Well, I heard. Hellfire Citadel. That's I don't remember which dungeon that is, or or even if I've seen that dungeon. Uh, was that a uh, 
Is that a wrath dungeon? Oh, that's Warlords. Yeah, I haven't seen it then. I think I have your hat, don't I? <laughs> Thanks for finding my hat. Now I can continue my witchy chat. Yeah, I hate how they they keep like consolidating dungeons. It's like, what if you just want to play the original one? Of course, they're still not as bad as Bungie and Destiny Two. Like they they just completely eliminate old content. How do I interact with this? Well, I did it in the wrong order anyway. Yeah, that was the correct order. It's just I'm not really sure how I'm supposed to do anything with those. Anyway, um... It's been about two hours. I realize we've had a power outage in that amount of time, but I'm going to take a little break. Uh, we're probably not going to do a full break uh, because of that interruption, but I do need to um, break the local recording and also, you know, have a little bit of stretch, refill my water and things, um, take my meds. And uh, so we'll be back in about five minutes or so with some more of ukulele.